Welcome to the Heart Hand Made UK YouTube channel. I quickly want to just introduce you to myself. I'm Claire and this is Poopers, probably the most important one. We would like to remind you to like and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell so you get those notifications for the next video. And now we can get on with the show. When it comes to doodling any kind of shape whatsoever, remember that everything starts with a line and basic shapes. Everything can be drawn from one line, whether it's wavy, starts out straight, you name it. Everything starts off simple. So you'll begin with a circle and then build on that and build on that and build on that and then soon you have a flower. So it's important to practice these shapes regularly. I think that you can see from this that I hadn't practiced in a while but I still I haven't lost it. So now we're going to connect the shapes so that you can see what you can make out of everything that I have shown you here on this journal. This would make a great scallop border for a date, adding dashed lines, creating banners or garlands. You can really do anything you want. You can doodle anything you want from simple shapes. I've got so many different uh, posts on the blog with doodle tutorials and you can see in every single one of them, they are really easy kind of three step type drawings. Well, not that far, but <laughs> but for the very first doodle that I did, you can see that it was three steps. And these are the most popular of doodles because they are the easiest to do. I have created some printable files for you, which I will show you at the end. It's basically come from my journal and I've made them a light gray so that you can draw over them easily and still see the color that you've used. So again, you can see that I was able to do flowers from the shapes that I've shown. This is how you draw books very easily. When it comes to drawing books, don't be afraid to make them sideways, make them lean against each other and make them all different sizes so that they actually look like books. And when it comes to drawing hearts, I really love to remember the fact that it is basically a V shape that's just all puffy. So even some brush pens will allow you to create a heart with a V. So you you write the V and the way the brush nibs work, it turns into a heart. And I think that arrows are the easiest to draw because you can just follow the dots that are in your journal. I absolutely love being able to doodle in my journal and I love the freedom that it gives me. And these basic shapes will just take you throughout your entire journal. Don't forget to download your free practice sheets. They will be in the YouTube description and in the post below. Now I wanna just take a little time to say a huge thank you to the new members in the Pretty Planner Printables Club on Patreon. That is a massive mouthful, so please excuse me. If you wanna check out the club, just go below and look for the link in the YouTube description and in the blog post. We would be more than happy to have you. If you love this video, I would be thrilled if you would share or leave a comment below.